Last episode, we set foot in the God Wars dungeon and unlocked two very powerful upgrades, the Armadale Crossbow and the Armadale Hilt. Unfortunately, we didn't get a single shard and that brings us back to God Wars. Welcome to episode 5. Oh wow, nice! An Armadale chestplate, not that bad. So I did a few kills since then. We're now at 83 kills. Yeah, we almost have all the drops from Armadil, but no shards. Okay, that's a relief. It's not bugged. We got our first shard. Very nice. That's the God Sword Shard 1. That's a unique as well. And a repeat shard. I want at least two God Sword Blades though, so this is pretty nice to have. There's our second God Sword Shard 1. I'm out of Runite Bolt, so I'm gonna go back to the Sepulchre. Okay, we made it here, and the time's looking pretty good actually, so I have a pretty nice chance at the 6 minute and 30 task. Now to put this in perspective, you need a time of 3 minutes and 45 by the 4th and 6 minutes by the 5th floor for this to be possible. Now I make a small mistake here so <laughs> the solution is to go even faster and it does pay off, well, sort of. Yeah, the run didn't count. Yes, we did it! That actually, I don't even need to kill the minions now. The Armadil God Sword, always one of my favorites, and soon I'll be able to put it to good use at Bandos mostly, but Zamorak and a whole bunch of places. Well, that was easy, like six kills. I'm going to cancel my task. Hill Giants counts for Cyclopses. I'm going to go for defenders now and start training my attack skill. There it is, 75 attack, the Armadil God Sword. 90 strength and I'm going to start training attack now. I also need the Adamant, Rune and also Dragon Defenders. There is the Dragon Defender, 86 attack. It took us 195 kills for all the defenders, some dragon boots, and of course the Abyssal Whip. So now I really have no excuse. I've been delaying it for quite a while because I've never done a melee fire keep before. Okay, wave 55 so far looking pretty good. I think we can move on to Jad. I don't think I'm going to be dying here too much. A3. Okay, yeah, this is going to be a pretty easy cape. Nothing but melees. I didn't say hand me the cape. Okay, that's a free 250 points. Equipped a fire cape, and that finishes all the elite Karamja tasks. A nice 800k smithing experience. 81 smithing, not bad. First Zamorak kill, that's a nice 250 points. And wow, 4 kills in, already have the Zamorak spear. I'm gonna make that into a Hasta. It's gonna cost me 300k, but I wanna do some Nightmare as soon as possible. Okay, and that's gonna be my first KC. I still have quite a bit to do. I need all my Zenites, and I also need 87 Slayer. So that's my goal for now. I'll be back once I'm finished.
Okay, well, I guess we can try out a few theater now that we got our amulet of torture. First run, 1722. That's not too bad. Zero deaths as well. Wow, we got mahogany seeds, adamant ore. That's a whole bunch of farming XP. Alright, Bandos is going to be the next grind. There's no Bandos items, so the first kills are going to be a bit rough. And then it should calm down once we get a few items. Nice, first Bandos kill. Feels so good to have a Bandos item. I'm not going to get attacked when I enter the room. And it's the good one too. There we go, that's 99 hit points, whole bunch of points too. Now we're at like 24,700, which isn't too bad. <laughs> we got the hilt. There it is. 49 KC. Yeah, we got the tacits. There we go. The Bandos God Sword, 5 defense reducing special attacks. This is going to help a lot at Nightmare and Theater of Blood. There are a few places where I still use the Armadale God Sword though. With the Slayer Helm accuracy, the Armadale God Sword is still pretty useful at Zamorak. Oh, okay, <laughs> that drop looks so good. Unfortunately, it went on a Ranger, but uh, yeah, it's a whole bunch of points at least. And that's going to be solo kill number 6. Okay, and there it is. That's the Ring of Endurance. We got it. Now I just need the 6 minute and 30 Sepulcher run. Oh no, I'm gonna miss it by a few seconds. I didn't take enough risks. 6 seconds. Well. Oh, that's so close. I might have got this by 1 second. And that completes the 6 minute and 30 Sepulcher task twice. Yeah, and there's all the tools from the shop. Death's Coffer. I'm going to be doing a bunch of PVM. There's no way I die this many times, so this should be good enough. And there's a bunch of farming XP. All those mahogany tree seeds that we got from Theater of Blood. Almost two levels from just these trees. Okay, and that's going to be our second Zenite. Anguish for the Theater of Blood in Armadale. We got another hilt. There, very nice. Oh, almost died there. Um, we got 99 attack, that's very nice. Okay, well there's another spear. It is done. The Staff of the Dead. And that's everything you need for Sarah. Really excited to start that grind. 26k points so far. The Ceridome and God Sword, that's the last key item for Nightmare, and then we're pretty much ready to camp it. Thanks everyone for watching, and good luck on Trailblazers.